Hey there everyone, welcome to the channel and to this video we're going to talk about how to fix camera missing on Allo Access tab on your iPhone for apps like Snapchat, Instagram or any other application on your iPhone. So this is really an annoying issue that most people are facing right now so we're going to show you some tips and tricks that you can apply on your iPhone to fix this problem. Now the first things you got to do just go ahead and open up your iPhone settings and then scroll down to your screen time and then go ahead and scroll down to your content and privacy restriction and then all you got to do just go ahead and tap allow apps and make sure that your camera application is turned on from here. Now if you see your camera is turned off that can cause this issue. Now for safety purpose all you can do is simply can turn off your content and privacy restriction for being able to make it work. Now afterward if you're still having the same problem the next things you guys got to do is simple just go ahead and head over to your settings and scroll down to your privacy. Now go ahead and tap on your privacy and then scroll down to your camera application and then all you have to do make sure you're allowing that application that is having problem with so let's say for example your Instagram your snapchat or Facebook or more you simply can show this option to make it work all right guys now the next things you guys got to do is simple just go ahead and try to remember whether you had allowed that a specific application on your camera while you installed that application on your iPhone okay now if you didn't do it the next thing you guys got to do is just go ahead and reinstall this application you simply can delete it from your iPhone and then reinstall this application back again to fix your problem and while you're just setting it up Make sure to tap allow to access your camera on that specific application to fix your problem. Even after that, you're still not really getting satisfied because you're still having the same problem. Last but not least, things you guys can do is simple. Just go ahead and open up your settings and scroll down to your general and then scroll down to your reset options. Now go ahead and give your reset all settings and then enter your password. Well, don't worry, it will not delete your data and content. This will only reset your settings options. Okay, now just go ahead and tap reset all settings. Now do it again and your iPhone will take auto restart and your problem will be fixed. Alright guys, so after doing all of this given process, hopefully your problem is solved so far and you'll be able to fix your problem. So if this video helps you out, please leave a like for this video and subscribe to the channel to get more tips and tricks for yourself. Thanks for watching guys and I'll talk to you all soon.